know those vacations where you come back home and you feel overfed, under-exercised, and like you never actually touched the soul of a place? We wanted to create the opposite of that. We created Movable Feast as a way to sort of have it all. We want you to wake up in a place that very much speaks to the soul of wherever you are and takes a deep dive into the rhythms, the philosophies, the, the music, the literature of a place without being super heavy-handed with it. We want you to have a great drink and see a beautiful vista, but also come home with an actual knowledge of a place. We have a focus on moving your body in a way that makes you feel vibrant when you return home, filling your stomach with food, but also filling your brain with beautiful thoughts. We want you to come home feeling nourished, both body and soul. And so we create opportunities to make that happen throughout every day of your trip. Leave it to the locals. We spend months, almost an entire year planning a one-week trip, and if you're just going on a vacation, you don't have time to put months of research into figuring out exactly what a place is all about. So let us spend months getting to the soul of a place so when you get there, it's like laid out for you in, in a curated and beautiful way. One of the most important things to us is finding the best, deepest parts about any given place. We think that you could probably find the best dinner in a given country at a five-star restaurant or at a street stand, but one without the other is a really difficult way to understand the full spectrum of what a place has to offer you. There's a quietness to a movable feaster that wants to be introspective and to feel the depth of life. At the same time, a movable feaster doesn't take life that dang seriously and the next night we'll be drinking some concoction that a French farmer made and howling at the moon. A movable feaster wants all of it and all of it and then all of it some more. What can travel be? It can be a movie that you replay to yourself when you look back and have these memories during the quieter times in life and realize like I smelled it and I was in it. That was a life well lived.